Hi, I'm Rob. I'll make you better. That's what I do. Uh, sometimes people have questions, you know, about specific instructional stuff. And uh, the reason why I don't have a lot of videos on fixing your slice, your hook, and a lot of the lasers or whatever else, because with my swing system, that doesn't happen. You don't need understanding. What you need is to do the drill that I posted, do, you know, chips and have pictures. Making sure you do a tilt and a lift. Make sure you videotape it down the line so you don't try to turn inside and all that stuff. Use thumb of the shaft, the enhanced version of the grip. Use thicker grips. I use a column arthritis with six or seven layers of grip tape or something like that. Uh, you have to experiment to find yourself best. Use a blade club and that's what you do. That's all you need. Because you have to rebuild your swing for a natural sequence because everybody teaching golf teaches you to struggle with golf. Right? They don't know it, so that's why they can tell you to put the thumb on the shaft. And I had someone on YouTube telling me, you know, what two pros using this? And I said, which era and decade are you talking about? 100 years ago, people won US Open with the grip I propose. People does not understand golf swings and golf swing dynamics. And that's the people teaching. Everybody else who's not a golf guru, they you know, a player, amateur or two pro, doesn't understand golfing anyway. And they would probably say something stupid, you know, that you don't understand anyway. Yes, you make you may understand a little bit of that. If you use what people told shoulder padding, for example, the first thing that goes out the window is distance control. Everybody who teach you modern body with shoulder padding means that you're distance control goes out the window. Now you have to relearn distance control that makes it more difficult to putt. And this is people who teach Rory Macro, for example. These are putting gurus who pay, I don't know how many, they pay $10,000 a year or $100,000 a year, I don't know, they pay a lot of money. And they teach Rory Macro that shit. Why do you think in last year's British Open he had 36 putts, he two putted every green. All he needed was two one parts. The average on tour, one parts during a run is nine. But Rory Macro, he two parted 36 parts. That's amateur level putting. So whoever is teaching him putting doesn't know what to do with. My specific instruction is very simple to understand. You need to do the drill, limit your and restrict your because your brain will then adapt to that contact. It won't feel good. Yes, you know it, it won't feel good. But you have to do it. I have a 60 year old, you know, who came in third place in a 72 hole tournament and his swing, just by doing this, has, you know, gone from, you know, where he was. And he tells me he has a little bit of, you know, arthritis in his hands up, no pain. He's, he plays now and he has no pain. Comes in third place in a 72 hole tournament and he's just happy. And he has access to the same information you have. Do the drill, follow my instruction, learn the drill because you need the skills. The reason why I don't have, you know, all those explanation videos of your golf swing, you know, your iron swing, or your driver swing, or your push, or your pulls, or slice and hooks fixes and because I don't need to fix anything and if you don't understand the difference that I'm the only one that can teach you golf in that actually works no one else in the world, world of golf can do that and I can't play golf because I have something called ME-CFS people kind of can't call it long COVID what it is is a viral infection and uh, once you you know normally you have a flu or a cold for like a week 10 days but sometimes when you have that, you don't recover. You get in what people call an energy fatigue. In some cases, people are bedbound or can hardly walk. Uh, some get, you know, concentration, uh, a little bit of a fast, it's hard to speak, very hard to follow conversations, stuff like that. And uh, it's very hard to explain because if you go to a doctor, uh, they can run all the tests, that, you know, that you usually do. but. The funny thing about this kind of illness is that all the tests will become back negative because they can't and haven't been able to identify a proper biomarker 
which means if you, normally you take a blood sample and then you, people will show that you have something because it's going to be in your blood and they have you know, tests for that. This kind of illness you don't have that. For 10 years I've been to every department in the hospital several times until they started to say I can't come back there because they can't find anything wrong. Because this kind of illness happens on the cellular level with ATP and energy reintegration and mitochondria and stuff like that. It's very, very hard to, you know, diagnose it. But anyway, so you understand how stupid it is. Now, a few years back, I'm out on the putting green and I had this 80 year old, you know, he liked to play golf and all that stuff. And he started, he was putting, you know, shoulder putting, all that stuff. And he was like three meter long, two meter short, you know, he was all over the map with his putting. And I, and I kind of said, you know, he needs help. So I walked over to him, I did, you know, this is what I do with putting, and I showed him what I teach him, how I putt. Try that. And he tried it out. Suddenly his balls were on the hole, suddenly. A couple of months later, you know, ran into him, and he told me, he made a long putt this summer, and he was so happy. 30 second lesson, 80 year old, it works, because he couldn't have distance control. So everybody who teaches this shoulder party know this. They make it more difficult to putt. And you don't know. And people you know that I teach use the party and they play and beat the crap out of the people that play. The first thing they say, you know, you, you shouldn't putt like that. And they're like, Well, I'm beating the crap out of you, so you know. And they usually tell, well, if you show the part, you will, you will be the crap out of me even more. They don't say that. Because they still believe what well, people teach Rory McIlroy. And Rory McIlroy haven't figured that out yet. Maybe he needs to hire someone else. I'm not going to tell you who that would be or something like that. Even though I can't work. But it, it's a fun thing to say. So you have to understand that that's all you need. Follow my instruction, do the drill. And some of you may need to do it for six months, maybe more, maybe less. But if you do that, you're gonna get better. Short game is gonna take off. But you have to use my grip, the horse version of it. You can't use the thumb on the shaft, it won't work. So if you think you can use the thumb on the shaft to learn my stuff, you can't. And no one out there in the world of God can explain that to you, but I can. But I choose not to. Anyway, my teachings and instruction is very clear. It's based on learning the skills, not talk about them, not understand them, but learning by doing. And if you do that, you're going to get rewarded at some point. If you don't, and you want to, you know, learn the thumb of the shaft and keep that, you have to go elsewhere. It's just how it is.